Welcome to Zoomtopia Studio. My name is Michelle Couture and I am the Customer Experience Product Marketing Lead. And today I am joined with Joseph Chul, who is our Head of Product Solutions and Industry Marketing at Zoom. Thank you for joining me today. Thanks for having me. Awesome. Well, I'm really excited to kick off this conversation. As you know, AI, huge hot topic. It's everywhere. We've been talking about it a lot at Zoomtopia as well. Definitely want to get your input. What excites you the most about AI innovation? Yeah, a few different things. First, I think, uh, and I've talked to a lot of people here about this, it's just a game changer in terms of enhancing people's productivity. Yeah. Um, so we've got some features around uh, meeting summary, for example, where it, it enables the possibility for no one ever to be like the designated note taker again. Yes. I just think about how much time that saves um, just in terms of people... Um, taking notes, the action items, summarizing them, send them out. The AI will do all of that for you. And that's just one example. Powerful. Yeah. Um, but it's increases productivity. Other pe The people in the meeting can focus on different things other than kind of rote tasks like that. Um, so productivity is one of them. The other is just um, the, the possibility of AI to, to enhance collaboration and communication. So things like writing emails for you based on the context of your previous emails or writing chats for you um, just helps me communicate with someone like you yeah. um, by, by making it that much easier. And then the second is the ability for the AI to kind of coach and level people up. So give them kind of real time feedback on um, how they're speaking or the sentiment in their conversations when they're in a meeting or um, whether there's too many pauses or how many questions they're having. It gives feedback, direct feedback um, to the knowledge worker on those things so that they can do better next time. So how do you see AI reshaping the landscape for employee collaboration and customer experience? Yeah, so um, on the employee collaboration side, um, we talked about productivity, but um, think about productivity in, in, in the sense of when we're collaborating in a doc together, um, the ability to populate that, that document using AI um, to give you some conversation starters about whatever, whatever topic or research that you're doing, and it'll, it'll populate content for you, organize it, synthesize it, um, and that, that'll also be a game changer in terms of productivity. Definitely. I think in the physical workspace, um, there's, there's a lot of opportunity just to make Sure, there's a better sense of connection in the physical workspace through more inclusion um, through through products that just detect and frame the um, the person when they're in the room so that when when there's a hybrid meeting, um, uh, then everyone has kind of equal framing in the meeting rather than people the people who are joining remotely feeling like outsiders because they can't really see what's going on um, in, in the room. Absolutely. And then um, the other is, is just that a sense of just driving employee engagement um, and um, and um, using AI to be able to you know write shout outs or um, give recognition in, in, in areas like um, our, our, our work vivo uh, offering where um, the AI can actually just help compose those messages um, for you, compose those those kudos. Um, and make it that much easier to give that or that recognition. Yeah, awesome stuff. I can definitely tell you as a remote employee, just being able to see everyone in the room, powerful, super powerful stuff. That's really awesome. So you know a lot has changed over the last couple of years. We've gone from in office to remote and then hybrid. What's your opinion, like the biggest win on going to more of this flexible work environment? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I think the word is, is, is flexible, right? So I'm a parent. Um, I think you're a parent too. Parent too, yeah. Yeah, so it just provides flexibility because um, I think what we learned is um, people can contribute well um, whether they're working from home or from the office. Of course, we swung way on the, on one side of the pendulum right. um, for a good while there, but but now different companies are experiencing are experimenting with all sort of different sorts of models. So um, what what I'm really excited about is just as a as a, a product marketer is the potential for technology to facilitate different ways of working, right? Whether we call it from wherever and whenever you're working. Uh -huh. And that's what we're, we're really focused on. It's, it's there's new customer needs in the kind of different flexible work styles that people have today. Um, and so how do we best solve for them to keep, keep employees engaged? Yeah, that's awesome. I love that. 
Now, last question for you. What advice would you give other product leaders like yourself who are navigating similar situations, hybrid environments, integrating AI into, into their teams? Yeah, I would encourage people to try things out. Ah, right? Yes. Um, and so from a product marketing perspective, I had a conversation the other day about um, using generative AI to kind of come up with different titles for articles that we could put out, like marketing articles, huh? and um, how useful that can be. Or it could, it could extend to uh, generating ad copy for different A-B tests that a marketer would want to do. Um, before, that would all have to be done manually, but it's a perfect use case for, for generative AI. From the events perspective, um, experimenting with things like using generative AI to write um, uh, imitation emails or event registration emails. There are just so many different things out there, but, but um, just having the awareness, learning about them, and then trying them, I think, is the approach that, that I'm taking. So we can figure out, okay, what's going to work and actually um, enhance this process and make it more efficient, more effective than it was before when we had to do things manually. That's such great advice. And as someone who's on your team, I definitely appreciate that <laughs> because it definitely makes our days a lot easier. Well, thank you so much, Joseph, for taking the time to talk with me today. This has been a great, great session. Thank you.